Okay. So let's pick this up. Listen to this little bit of nonsense. When Picasso became bored of painting people, he started representing them as cubes and other abstract forms. The world called him a genius. I've spent my entire surgical career creating the same tired shapes over and over again. The upturned nose, the cleft chin, the ample bosom. Wouldn't it be wonderful if I could do with a knife what that old Spaniard did with a brush? And so begins his descent into being a crazy, crazy, crazy bastard. But anyway, let's investigate what else we can do up here. Check our map. Uh, we got the surgery foyer, that little area up there we're not going to be going into anytime soon. But there is this little place down here, and I've already cleared a path to it, so let's go investigate it. We're not really sure where, where telekinesis is at this point, so why not? Hello? Anybody home? Don't mean to be it. A bother, I'm just kinda... Howdy. Cool. And we got a door code, 0451. Which we are going to be using here shortly. Let's search this everything, make sure we're not missing anything. And this key code is... Oh, four, five, one. Hooray! We got free shoes. Also, a lot of cool things. Automatic hack tools are very nice for if you decide to get really lazy or you can't hack something that you should be able to otherwise. Hello! I saw you in here. No, I'm running because I want to get an electro bolt off on you. Like that one! I should also mention that if you get behind someone, you do a little bit more damage with the wrench. Um, even before you get any, like, bonuses that help out with that. So that's what we're going to be doing. We're going to be trying to get an advantage, um, to that extent. Pick some stuff up in here. Oh, no. Nope, 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 nope. And hack successful, yay. So now that we've got that done, I'm going to take a quick save really quick. Because we got beta chambers disabled, which means if I die, I'm going to have to replay a lot. So we're going to be saving a lot as a result. And uh, this would be hard otherwise, but we're going to auto-hack it. What's in this safe? Ooh, some money. Money's always good. Money, money, money. Um, alright. So we've investigated both of these little canals. Well, let's go back in here and see what's going on. Oh, hey, look, a morgue! I bet this won't be creepy at all. Well, yes, that was a body that just went floating by. What do we do about that, ladies and gentlemen? Do we investigate? Yes, we do! No. I think that's our turret. Uh-oh! I know I saw someone in here. Security expert! Awesome. Reduces difficulty when hacking turrets, bots, and cameras. Very, very, very useful at this point in the game. Well, you're not looking too good, are ya? <laughs> I didn't make it very much better. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, buddy. Alright, let's wait on back on through here. I knew you were going to come out of there. I saw you earlier, you jerk. And now you're stuck in the wall. <laughs> oh, that is, that is priceless. I absolutely love it when stuff happens like that. Alright, cool. So what we got in here? I think this turret was going off earlier. Couldn't be wrong. But uh, that's the whole reason we came in there in the first place. So let's check our map really quick. Um... Looks like the next place we need to go is downstairs. So let's go downstairs and uh, do some searching around there. A rapture reminder: the bottom of the ocean is Hello. Awesome, but it can also be a let's hack this place. thing. And hacked. What we got?
out here. We can we buy really quick. Oh, we can ha get a heck of a lot of hypos. Lovely. That's exactly what I wanted. Yeah, electrical. Hmm. Looks like a fun little place. Anything of value in here? Whoa. <laughs> I'm not sure where that fell from, but okay. I really can't handle alcohol. IRL as well. I'm not, I'm not even just talking about the game. I hear someone talking in there. They obviously don't like me. Alrighty. Uh, I think we've checked all the crates and stuff in here. I'm not sure if we need um, incinerate for much else, but I could be wrong. Hang on a second. Before I go into dental, I'm gonna do a really, really, really quick check of my map. I think Twilight Fields and that place are the only two places that I really need to worry about needing incinerate for now. So let's keep on going down there. Simon, I know medical limited is your matter, but you might want to cut it. Ocean water is colder than all she's tip. You don't heat the pipes, the pipes freeze. Pipes freeze, pipes burst. Then wraps your legs. Now, I realize you're a posh sort of geezer, and frankly, I don't give a toss if you piss or go fishing. But once rapture starts leaking, the old girl's never gonna stop. And then I'll be sure to tell Ryan he's got you a thing. Pretty much. So let's go in here really quick. Uh, uh oh! I saw that. That is a rocket turret. So let's hack it. Ow! Crap! Turret, what the hell? Oh, you're shooting at friends. You shoot at those people. Keep going, buddy. That's what I hacked you for, because you were a tremendous asset to me. Haha, <laughs> she exploded! Good job, mate. Good job. You just keep firing those rockets. Alright. Let's get on through here. And I think that we have a security camera. Yep, that's a security camera. Hello. And done. You'll notice uh, that I do a lot of hacks in midair in this game. I'm not doing that just to be impressive. I, it's just what I have to do. Auto hack the safe. And goodies. Cool, cool. So, what we got up in here? Oh, here's the splicer my friend blew up. My bestest, goodest friend. And we get our first happy, super crazy, awesome tonic, Wrench Jockey. Wrench Jockey good. Wrench Jockey good. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, I love Wrench Jockey. It is pretty much my favorite plas... Come on. Let me through there. Thank you. It is pretty much my favorite plasmid. Because of that. Because it... It is deadly, and it is good. So I'm going to be using Wrench Jockey pretty much the whole freaking game. Um, because our wrench is pretty much the master sword, as far as weapons are concerned. Um, pretty dorky little reference there, but I'm hoping you got it. Anyway, um, so let's run in here, and I see... Oh, is that a shotgun? No one around. I'm just going to take it. Uh oh, what's going on? What's going on? I don't like this. 
Hello? Uh oh. Tacky little nothing! Oh, where are you? <laughs> oh, tram! Clean it up! I've got rich shocky. You guys don't have a bloody chance. I don't need the shotgun for this. Any more? Any more? Any more? I didn't even use a health kit. Oh yeah. All right, so we got money, 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 money. Logbox is out the butt, and we just got our shotgun, which is something we're actually not going to use very much until later. Um. And now that I have nine health kits again, I can go back to feeling invincible and just running around like a crazy, crazy man. Um, let's go ahead and do our little save for now. Just like that. Okay. So, what we got down here? We got a dental services area. Uh, dandy dental. Do we need to get in there yet? Hmm. No, we'll, 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 we'll do that in a little bit. That little area is something I'm gonna I'm gonna save. Supply. Um, I don't think we need um the uh the the, the, the plasma I'm thinking about anymore. So maybe we should go ahead and go into Dandy Dental. Yeah, let's do that. Let's go ahead and go into Dandy Dental and say hello to everyone in here. The stars up with some band-aids. Oh, crap. A turret, or, uh, <laughs> a turret. Yeah, that's a turret, all right. That looks exactly like a turret. Hack minigames for saves are, er, saves. Safes are not as easy as other minigames, because safes are very small, as you can see, so the panel fills up quite quickly. So, normally I like to auto-hack those. Really, also I use my auto-hacks on things that are just ridiculously difficult for absolutely no real reason. Um, which brings me back to a point. I was saying that the only thing I buy from vendors is EVE hypos. That's actually a lie. I do get a lot of auto-hacks later. What is this? Is this a turret? It's not firing at me. Hmm. Oh, there's a telekinesis. Awesome. What are we going to replace it with? We're going to replace Incinerate, because I don't think we need Incinerate anymore. Throw objects at foes. You can even catch grenades and throw them back. I catch a grenade for ya. Okay. So, what does Telekinesis do? Well, this is a really good example. I have a tennis ball. Tennis ball is what I have. So, tennis ball! <laughs> yeah. Pretty much. Um, picking up things and throwing them is a really effective method of combat in this game. Because I used telekinesis once. How much uh, Eve did it take up? Not that much. So, really, if you can telekinesis something in combat, I would do it. I would do it quite immediately. Because uh, it's a very cheap, um, not cheap as in, like, overpowered cheap, cheap as in, like, cost cheap to use telekinesis. Plus, uh, it's pretty fun when you can lob grenades back at people. And I did hear that turret, thank you very much. And I see a key on the wall. Can we grab it? Yes, we can. Chomper's dental office key. And let's see here if we can open this door. No, we can't. So how are we going to get in this room? Uh, I'm trying to remember... Okay. I think I'm going to try to electrobolt that turret and then climb in through the window. Alright, let's try it. Three, two, one. Oh, come on! Get through the window! Through the window, through the wall! There we go. 